An Adrian family shares their joy a year after a successful heart transplant. Emma Henderson brings you the good news in a story you'll only see on Fox 36. Christmas time of 2019, we introduced you to Gabe Villanueva. He had to stay attached to a machine that kept his heart pumping. As a teen, he had already suffered multiple heart attacks and a life-threatening clot. He needed a new heart to survive. He was given his gift of life on January 27th, 2020. And we were there when he came home 10 weeks later. Now, a year out, he's almost unrecognizable. So much has changed in my life as far as my strength, my um, state of mind, um, my limitations. Simple tasks are not taken for granted by Gabe or his mother. From being able to hop in the shower to buying and being able to drive his own car. To have him away from us, out of our sight, it was a little uneasy at first. But um, we've adjusted and now it's amazing. When you walk in their home today, it looks like Valentine's Day with a tree full of red hearts in the front room. I was just reading all the messages that people had um, wrote on the hearts for me. You know, it just shows me that I had a lot of support through my journey and I was never alone. The tree sat in their window for the years Gabe waited for his transplant. And this year begins a new tradition. It's put up on the date of his gift of life and stays for one month with a few new additions. One reading, answer to prayer, 12720. In Adrian, Emma Henderson for WTOL 11 on Fox 36.